mambo ya abatoire ambaye iko hapa because we want to make Isiolo being the center of Kenya the place where we are going to drive the transformation of our republic Wangwana Isiolo mnanielewa mnanielewa sikizeni sikizeni tumekubaliana vile vile mimi naenda hapa ngaramara kutoa titles elfu moja lakini hii town ya Isiolo imekwama kwa sababu watu wengi wako na ardhi lakini hawana title deed. Mimi nataka niwahakikishie nitarudi hapa kabla ya Disemba. Tayari nimeambia waziri na yuko hapa. Nimemwambia PS na yuko hapa. Titles elfu saba ya watu wa Isiolo town mimi nakuja kuwapatia kabla ya Disemba. Yenye yenye mnanielewa? Mnanielewa watu wa Isiolo? Nyinyi ni watu wazuri sana mlinipatia kura yenu na mimi nitawafanyia kazi bwana. Nyinyi mnanielewa? Tuko pamoja. Na mbali na hiyo titles, sikizeni. Hapa Isiolo vile vile. Mimi nataka ni wahakiki This year, in the next two to three years, ile adjudication section zote title did ni mesema ya kwamba mwaka hu, I have already issued instructions to the Ministry of Finance and the Public Service ya kwamba tuajiri valuers ya wizara ya ardhi wengine mia moja ndio tuwakikisha kwamba kazi ya adjudication inatembea araka na mambo ya issuance na titling katika taifa letu la Kenya liende kwa kasi. Tunaelewana jameni? Watu wa Isiolo tumekubaliana? Mnataka tupange kazi namna hiyo? Hapa nimeambiwa hapa kuna ardhi ambayo ni ya watu wa prison ambaye wanalima hapa town. Nimesema hiyo hii ardhi ambayo iko hapa tutaibadilisha iwe county aggregation and industrial park. Na hapa sikizeni Sikizeni hapa tunabadilisha kwa sababu nimekubaliana na huyu gavana wenu County government itoe shilingi milioni miambili hamsini National government tutawapatia shilingi milioni miambili hamsini tuweke hapa shilingi milioni tano tujenge county aggregation and industrial park ambayo itatumika kukusanya mazao yenu yote tufanye hapa aggregation tutafute storage tuweke cold rooms tuhakikishe kwamba kuna value addition tunafanya manufacturing tuongeze pesa na tupange ajira ya hawa vijana Mwana nielewa watu wa Isiolo? Na mimi nataka ni mwambie governor apange harakishe mimi nataka nikikuja hapa kabla ya Disemba nikuje nianze ujenzi wa county aggregation and industrial park hapa wakati nitakuja kufanya Tunaelewana? Tuko pamoja? Vile vile watu wa Isiolo mimi nataka niwashukuru sana. Niwaambie kazi yetu ambayo tumeanza. Mimi niliwaambia baada ya uchaguzi kitendawili haitaanza. Ni kazi itaendelea. Yenye mnataka watu watuanzishie hata kitendawili ya maandamano. Mimi nataka niwashukuru wa Kenya. Nataka niwashukuru wa Kenya wote kwa sababu wa, wa Kenya wameongea na sauti moja wamesema hawataki fujo hawataki vita hawataki kuharibu mali 
hawataki kuharibu ma, ma, maisha ya wananchi hawataki kuharibu biashara ya watu sisi tumeongea kama wa Kenya na sauti moja tumeambia wapinzani wasiharibu nchi yetu siasa inaamuliwa kwa kura siasa haiamuliwi kwa vita ya maandamano ni kweli ama si kweli isiolo tunakubaliana sisi si wote tulienda kwa uchaguzi sisi tulichagua ma MCA na magavana na maseneta na wabunge na simulipika kura ya rais iliisha ama ilibaki iliisha ama ilibaki si kura iliisha hawa watu tunawaambia our good friends the people of Kenya have spoken loudly and clearly that they do not want chaos they don't want violence they don't want anarchy they don't want destruction of property they don't want destruction of business they don't want public property to be destroyed the people of Kenya have said we are a democratic country we respect the votes of ordinary citizens and when the people of Kenya have spoken it is like God has spoken there is no way that we are going to change what our democracy stands for and what our country stands for tunaelewana jameni watu wa isiolo tunaelewana and i want to tell the people of Kenya that all of us must protect our country we must Every part of Kenya have said we cannot sabotage our economy using violence and destruction of business and destruction of property Kenya is the only place we have to call home and we must protect it by all means we must protect our democracy we must protect the peace in our country because it is a collective responsibility of all of us as citizens na mimi nataka niwaambie polisi wetu hongera kwa kusimama kidete na kuhakikisha kwamba kuna amani na kuhakikisha kwamba walifu wa wote wanachukuliwa hatua ndio tuhakikisha kwamba kuna amani Kenya na hakuna vita na mali biashara ya wananchi isiharibike na biashara na mambo ya uh, equipment na, na vifaa yote ya serikali isiharibike tunaelewana jameni mimi nauliza nyinyi isiolo barabara kama hii tumetumia pesa nyingi ambazo nyinyi mmetoa alafu mtu mwingine anataka kucha kuchoma hiyo barabara mtakubali barabara ichomwe ichom, ndio kama tunaelewana tuko pamoja jameni tuko pamoja we must say with clarity mambo yetu ni matatu nataka niseme nikiwa hapa isiolo mambo yetu ni matatu tunataka tupange mambo ya kilimo ili tuondoe aibu ya njaa na tumeweka pesa kwa mambo ya fertilizer mwaka huu tutaongeza pesa ya kusaidia credit wakulima wetu tuzalishe chakula ndio tuondoe aibu ya njaa katika taifa letu la Kenya watu wa isiolo ni waulize hata ukiweka sufuria miaka kumi kwa kichwa bei ya unga itapungua hata ufanye maandamano